has been faithfully serving the communities of St. Martin, powering your home and our economy. Come rain or shine, our qualified team of professionals are working hard 24 hours a day to provide you and your family with safe, reliable electricity and water. We use the latest technologies and test our products daily to maintain the highest international standards. Our friendly staff is always there to assist you, whether in person, over the phone, or online. We are committed to constantly improving our products and services, making them more efficient, effective, and environmentally friendly to serve you better today and our next generation of clients tomorrow. GEBE, -E, powering a brighter future. Our friend Mega Wadi is here with tips to save you energy. One, turn your air code temperature up. Two, use a ceiling fan instead. Three, buy energy saving products. Save some green with NVGEBE. -E. Hi, thanks for supporting our work. Thanks for everything. We had a good time at Cooper Avon this year. As you can see, these are some of our stuff that we have here our clutches, pencil cases. For the children to go back to school, which is very soon from now. We have natural soaps here. Natural soaps for the skin, different um, passion fruits. We have glory cedar, coconut milk, clove, cinnamon, pumpkin spice. We have different. Um, um, Right. We have the homemade bread. Well, you come too late. We have the last That's one here. Last one. Last one is cranberry. We have all flavors: blackberry, naturally made earrings made by me, and made me earrings. Different styles, different colors. Yeah, that's what we remain for tonight. So, so if thanks. you need your custom made, come check us out. <laughs> You know, this evening is again testimony of the strength and resilience of St. Martin. That again, St. Martin, besides having Cope Avon, which is the end of the culmination of the Cope Avon weeks of events, is now the Walichi Best SXM weekend. And that is again a testimony to the collaborative efforts of Friends St. Martin and Dutch St. Martin. As the people of St. Martin know, we have but one St. Martin. And that is why I'm here proudly standing next to my colleague and counterpart, Ms. Valerie Damasu, the Vice President of the Collectivity of St. Martin. And together we are here to talk about the events, not only for tonight, but the events of the entire weekend, bringing local and international artists to St. Martin. And again, bolstering the need to see St. Martin's economy flourish on all levels. It gives me also a great honor to stand next to my counterpart, the Minister of Seattle, of course, and this evening encouraging what has become 
one of the best festivals in the Caribbean, I must say. And I, I, I want to take this time out to applaud the um, organizers. I mean, Skelet and Mr. Rood, they're doing a tremendous job. And again, it gives us as ministers great honor to know that beyond ministry, that the people of St. Martin also knows the importance of cooperation. And in, in order to move forward or bouncing back, we definitely need the help of each and every one of them. And today, tonight, I must say, and this entire weekend will demonstrate just that. I, I really want to applaud them, but I also want to applaud all of these artists that took the time to come out because they could have said, no, nah, I'm not coming. I mean, all the images that has been put on the outside about St. Martin, they could have said, you know what, I'm not taking that risk. However, they have trusted in the friendly island that they knew still exists because a lot of them came here already and they know what St. Martin has to offer. And I'm very pleased to know that oh, not only in ministry, but as a people, we realize the strength of togetherness. So for this, I applaud the um, organizers of the Walichi Festival and I wish everyone is safe, safe, safe weekend. There's always a way to have fun but let's do it safely and responsibly. And I employ the people of St. Martin to again use social media, use the World Wide Web to again sell St. Martin to the world, show St. Martin is resilient and our people are resilient and again I extend on behalf of the government of St. Martin a well, well deserved weekend, a well organized weekend and let this be the first of many annual events that showcases St. Martin's local, international and regional potential to the world. So enjoy. Hey ma, how are you doing? You busy? I hear, just paying some bills, taking care of business, you know what it is? <laughs> I know, you're doing your online banking. I don't have to stand in those long lines to pay bills. I can transfer when I want, I can check my account wherever. It's like the bank open 24-7. I even hear checking the statement right now as we're talking. How's Miami? Well, that's why I'm calling. I'm finishing up a few songs now. But I'm afraid that studio time might be more than I thought. And I was wondering if I could get some help with some funds and I could pay you back as soon as I get back to St. Martin. Let me check my account. How much you need? I think 500 should be enough. I can transfer it to you while you're online. Direct from me to you. No problem. Great. Thank you so much, Ma. I'll get online with Bib now. All right, darling. 
You know who you're for? <laughs> I need to know who you're for. Contact Web today for your complete personal online banking experience. Available for all mobile devices, the Wynwood Islands Bank, now your online banking partner in progress.
Thank you so much, St. Martin! It's been said that behind every door, possibility awaits. How much possibility depends on which door you open first. Every day, we help our customers discover the possibilities in their lives. It all starts with a conversation. Scotiabank. Discover what's possible. Hello, Sir Martin. My name is Jose Helga and I play basketball. I have organized basketball events in St. Martin. Sport matters to me because it makes everybody come together in unity. So I challenge the businesses community to step up for sports and help us rebuild and repair our facility. I'm also asking the community to nominate local businesses in your area to take on the challenge and step up for sports because sports matter. Check out the Department of Sports SSN Facebook page for more information. Hashtag sport matter, hashtag are you in. One. Two. Three. Four. This is how common it is to develop a mental illness. One out of every four. 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 But there is hope. Today, most mental illnesses can be managed and treated. Visit your general doctor if you feel concerned about your thoughts and behaviors or have some difficulty dealing with some of life's issues. If you have been diagnosed and are suffering from a mental illness, keep in mind these four points to help you manage your mental health. One. Get regular checkups with your general doctor. Two, stay on your treatment plan to prevent relapses. Three, find a strong support group in your family and friends. And four, never be afraid to ask for help and look for the one signs of your illness. Remember, you are not alone. We are as close as one. Two, three, four. Learn about mental health illness by going to the Mental Health Foundation's website at www.mhf-sxm.com. launch of the Walichi XXM Best Weekend um, Festival. Today we start off the, the, the festival at um, the boardwalk. Um, it's, we call it Captain Hodge Wharf, but I don't call it by the courthouse. <laughs> so um, it's an all-white party tonight, open, free, jazz, classy, nice, looking good party. Because tomorrow, Friday, we have Soka versus Dancehall. Um, everybody excited um, for the eighth edition of Soka versus Dancehall. Um, we have um, Mr. Vegas representing the Dancehall um, team. And Ke uh, Karen Dubois, not here yet, but representing Soka team. So tomorrow, uh, tomorrow night, we're looking forward to see everyone there. And um, on Saturday is Melange. Um, with Kes the Band, Barrington Levy, Jean Marc Fendina, Youth Wave, um, Connors and Friends, Naked and Friends, DJ Biggers, and Shadow Man. Um, also, this, this night will be great because it's, you know, how do you call that? It's a big people thing, you know? <laughs> yeah. Um, on Sunday, we're going over the friend side, um, and they all have to think. Um, 
of our president, um, of Tories Bureau, um, that support the event and say, yes, we will, we will work with you guys and we will make it happen. And everybody knows it's not easy to put um, a type of event, a three, four day um, festival. And from we start, um, Miss um, Valerie Damoiseau, um, support and push this event, you know, make sure that, that everything happens. She and she team, I have to big up um, Gregor out that right there because he, like, one o'clock in the morning, he's sending me emails and WhatsApp that I like, he, I asked him myself, he, he ain't got no way. <laughs> so, um, yes, on Sunday, we call it Walichi Love. Walichi Love is, is um, going to be a wonderful um, beach party. For a lot of people in St. Martin don't know Happy Bay Beach. Happy Bay Beach is a private, beautiful beach, and we get the authorization to do the Walichi Love Beach um, Festival um, party on that day. We will have Big Band, um, Charles Marshall, R.E.C. Redeku, um, Oswald, that's right there, Kenyo, T.G. Band, DJ Maestro, DJ Orcas, DJ Chris Smith, um, DJ Dunkirk, JP, and many more. This, this, this day is our big, big, big day because we start early and we don't even mid midnight. Um, we start at 1 and we finish at midnight.